you know, paraphrasing Ralph McGeehee, the great CIA whistleblower, today's fake news is tomorrow's fake history. And so yesterday's fake history frames today's fake news. <laughs> so this is a Cold War redux feedback loop, right? And um, what is fake news again? It's nothing new. It's misinformation. It's disinformation. It's propaganda. It's information control. And you go back to the 1960s, you recall the Grams over at the Washington Post um, yeah, I guess that's still the CIA paper of record with uh, Jeff Bezos and the $600 million cloud contract they've gotten. Um, uh, journalism is the first rough draft of history. Uh, and if that's the case, we really need to get it right the first time. And I don't mean with the disinformation that we saw in these legacy papers buttressing Cold War propaganda. I mean, you know, going back to George Seldes and I.F. Stone, meaning that the role of journalists is to tell the public what's actually going on. And if we do go back in our history and the independent alternative annals of our past, we have long had truth tellers. We've long had people telling us what was happening, whether it's long before the Cold War, during or since in its next or new recent iteration.